Mm. Not bad coffee, that. Anyway, it's Sunday. And I literally have nothing else better to do but, uh, you know, pull things to pieces. So if you know what this is, 10 points for you. So let's get stuck into it. So this right here is my little setup. Got me coffee. Got all the parts on the ground there. And this is my air compressor. This is the uh, very first air compressor I ever bought. And she's a thumper off of a um, four drive super center. The very first thumper, and I've had it for probably about, oh, what would be four years at least. So I thought it's uh, a good time for an overhaul. This is the head. A couple of little valve flappy things go on that. But if you can tell, it's all dirty. Everything in here, here's a cylinder, or the ball. See all that crap in there? It's all sand. And I've looked after this thing. <coughs> It's lasted very well for this long, but that's the actual piston itself. It's made of that really weird, cheap alloy stuff, but, you know, look how much dirt and stuff is on that. And anyone who knows engines should not have that much stuff in there, so. Probably got it just in time. There's sand down the bottom of the, uh, well, what would you call it, the sump, I guess, down in there. You can just see it. I'm going to whip that base off. Oh, here we go, she's going to come out, look at that. See if I can try it with one hand. Sounds like a coffee cup, oh no I can't because the, um, oh can I? Gently, oh look at that, oh yeah, there goes the sand, look at that. Oh dear, there she goes. That's what's inside of there, that's alloy. Those plastic components over there as well, plastic. So, I'm going to drop him over there just to safekeeping. I've got to clean everything up, make everything look pretty again. But I just thought I'd show you guys what's inside one of these air compressors while I'm at it. So that's a weight, or that's the, um, oh, what would you call that? Just some sort of balance. It's the, um, oh, you can see how it works. I can't remember the name of it. But yeah, that's what makes the compressor go up and down. It's just like a giant weight in the end of the shaft there. And uh, it's offset to the actual main shaft. And when that spins around, it offsets the piston that goes up and down. So, very good design, really. This is the very first thumper. It's lasted me so long. I bought it when I uh, first started to off-road my Nissan, my Patrol. It's worked absolutely marvellously, and now it's uh, kept in the back of the Daihatsu. So, just for the occasional off-road. She's getting a bit old, but looks still looks pretty good. That's a uh, sealed bearing on there. Doesn't have any play in it. Is that a sealed bearing? Yeah, it might be. I've actually had one of these, one of these break before. Rod knock Rodney come visiting. That wasn't nice. But yeah, no, I just thought I'd whip this apart and uh, show you blokes what's going on. And this is what I'm doing on my weekend. Fixing my air compressor. Although I do have like three of the damn things. So, whoops. So yeah. coffee <clears throat> right so I um taken the case off the uh, magneto thingy my bum that's full of ginormous magnets there so, I had to label it that sides the piston that sides to the pair which is where the switch is you know I know what it means here's your watching my call it and the armature on the other end Everything in here, got a little bit of dirt there, but that's alright, these are magnets. Um, just having a quick look. It's all brand new still, really. There's nothing wrong with that at all. There's no signs of uh, abnormal wear or anything on it. It's very clean. No uh, stuff down in the grooves there. I mean, I'm going to get some emery paper and give it a bit of a sand off anyway. Give it a bit of a clean up. Got a clean out in there, that's a bearing in there. At least I think it is. It could be just a bushing. It might be a bearing. Makes sense if it was a bearing. That's that piston I was t uh, talking about earlier. And over here is the brushes. The whole the thing that uh, makes this thing go wiggle wiggle. So yeah, I'm looking at these. Look, they've got heaps of meat on them. Well, they're spring loaded. Which is good. Let's get that in there. 
Kind of hard to see. Don't have the light right. No, my camera won't focus. Yeah, there we go. A little bit worn, but still got heaps of meat on them. So, I mean, it's nothing really. Nothing really that really needs replacing in there. They're still like all hunky dory. Bit of a clean up around the outside there. Got a bit of dust. That's probably from the brushes wearing out. I don't know. There's a little bushing in there. I might give that a bit of a clean out. I don't think I'll muck around with it too much. I might just uh, clean it and rub a bit of grease in there. Yeah, you know, it's nothing really out of the ordinary. Which is good. Good to give her a service. Make sure everything's all good. Now, I did have problems with this. I'd get to the third tyre and um, all of a sudden she'd stop pumping. She'd just uh, overheat and turn off. But uh, I reckon that's must just, just because of this sand in here. Yeah, all that sand. Ah, that was the other thing I was going to show you too. This damn camera, I tell you. Sick of it. There we go. Right. All this sand. Doesn't look like much. There's your dustpan. Doesn't look like much. But, uh, yeah, that's how much sand was in that motor. Not fun. So it's good that I uh, pulled it apart and checked her out. I mean, I have owned this for probably got four or five years. It's getting pretty old, but it still works perfect. You're due for a service, so that's what I'm going to do. Now I'm going to clean her out, grease her up, and put her back together, I suppose. See if it works. Hopefully it does. Better than, uh, better than I bought one. So, uh, that's a... all right. I'm gonna hook her up to the old diet suit here. And then I find my lead. Do this. Make sure I haven't got the power around the wrong way. No, nope, she's all good. I'll put that on. Like that. Earth is on. Righto. Let's see if we can break something. Actually, kind of nervous. Here, ready, set. Beauty. Works good.